should I hide? Oh, I didn't see. This looks good. <laughs> oh, here you are. Oh, no one's here. How? Huh? Is anyone out there? Oh. Uh, thank you very much, Swallowtail Butterfly. As a reward for saving me, I invite you, Miss Dury, to the Butterfly Kingdom. Wow! Butterfly Kingdom? Uh, I'm sorry, but I can't fly. <gasps> uh. <gasps> huh? Oh! <laughs> wow! Now I have butterfly wings, too! If it weren't for you, I wouldn't have made it back to the Butterfly Kingdom. Would you be the princess of our Butterfly Kingdom? <gasps> Wait, a princess? Do you mean me? Mm, yes, please! <laughs> <laughs> I really love the Butterfly Kingdom so much. There's such beautiful flowers everywhere. I'm so happy to be the Butterfly Princess. <laughs> Hurry! Oh. Dury, huh? what are you doing? Hey, Dury, let's go. Uh, no, but I want to stay here with the prince. Butterfly prince, butterfly prince, butterfly prince. Huh? <laughs> Who's the butterfly prince? Well, it's your turn to seek now, Dury. Uh -huh. Let's all hide. <laughs> <laughs> Oh, do you mean it was all just a dream? Oh. Jack train coming through. Move out of the way. <gasps> what? Jack, you ruined my block tower with your train. Now it's our turn. What? No way. The train is mine. Sweetie. <laughs> Long, long time ago, three pheasant brothers lived together in the desert. The eldest had a pair of magic binoculars. Oh, the second brother, oh, brother had a magic you? carpet he could fly around yeah. on. And the youngest had a magic potion he could use to cure any sickness yeah. ever. Everyone, tell the whole country that we will give a great reward to whoever can cure my daughter. Then I should go fly over right now! <laughs> but wait, where is she? It's a secret only I know. Right then, I'll give you a ride. All right! Wait, but in order to cure her illness... Okay, fine. Chip, hop on. All right, let's go! The three brothers flew all day under the hot sun. It's a sandstorm! They flew right into the stinging sandstorm! And finally, they arrived at the princess's castle. I shall give you a great reward. Mm -hmm. Oh no, well, I wouldn't have been able to come here to help without using Jack's magic carpet. Without being able to use Bobby's binoculars, we wouldn't have even known that the little princess was ill. Give great rewards to the three brothers who saved my daughter. Yay! Yes, my queen. The three brothers worked together to save the princess, and that's the lesson of the story. If you gather all the toys and play with them together as a group, wouldn't that be more fun? That's true! My dream is to be a teacher at a school. Oh! My dream is to live in a house made of corn! <laughs> and here's the door! I'm going to be the king of the fours. Make way for King Jack! That's it. Dream? Oh, Chip, he doesn't have any dreams. Not true! I do have dreams. What happened to it? Huh? Oh, no! Chip! Yeah. Your mom seems mighty worried. Hmm. Hello there, little baby uh, birds! Oh, there they are! Hello, Hello all you birds! Hello, Hello to you all! all. Oh. Mommy, 
What was that huge thing that was yellow? That thing was a bug. Huh? I know what I want to do! My dream is... To be a bug! Go, Chip Bus! Go for a ride! <laughs> go, Chip Bus! It's a wonderful bus, and when we're on it, it's always marvelous. You can call Chip Bus whenever you need to. <laughs> oh, but Mommy, don't you have your own dream too? Hmm. Well, my babies. Uh -huh. All my dreams have already come true. <laughs> Mom, Mom. Mommy! They're big snowflakes. <laughs> There, it's cold outside. You need to keep yourselves warm. <laughs> Here are the eyes and nose. We made it! It's time for dinner already. Kids, let's go inside. Okay, okay Mom! Mom, can he come with me, please? The snowman has to stay outside. His home is this snowy field. Okay. Oh, Sleep well and play with him again tomorrow, okay? Uh, okay, Mom. Before that, I have a story to tell you. Huh? A story? A long, long time ago. Ready now? <laughs> Once upon a time, there was a giant pheasant in a forest. Hello there. The giant pheasant quickly <laughs> became friends with the animals in the forest. <laughs> When his friends were in trouble, he could easily solve the problem. And he would bring down the stars for his friends who were afraid of the dark. All the forest animals loved the pheasant and praised their friend frequently. There were also hard times for the giant pheasant. The giant pheasant would blow his friends away with a sneeze. Or he would spoil games with his huge body. Hey, let me play with you. And so all of his friends left and he became lonely. In the end, the giant pheasant left the forest. So then, who is first in line to become a giant? Ooh, I don't want to be a giant! <laughs> Me neither. I like the way it is now. <laughs> Goodbye, Goodbye, Granny Fox! Fox. 
here. Subscribe to our channel.